army boy here and today i'm bringing you guys another division 2 build video and in this build video i'm going to be showing you guys this build i made using the exotic chest piece the race race pride and i'm also using two piece golden gear and three piece hunter's fury and this build is um like revolves around bleed damage and um armor regeneration and armor on kill so hope you guys enjoy make sure you guys like comment subscribe subscribe to the build so first I'm going to start off with my weapon here using the SMG the MP5 ST replica and um, I don't have any max style attributes but I do have damage to target out of cover and um, this weapon is just doing enough damage the way it is. If it had maxed out I would be doing way more but it's good enough where it's at. And I'm also using the talent um, Sadis which helps me deal 20% weapon damage to bleeding enemies. And after 4 kills, I apply bleed to the next enemy I hit, but that doesn't really matter. With the Ridge Race Pride um, chest piece, we go over to it now. Every time I shoot an enemy within 15 meters, it applies bleed to the target, so I don't have to wait for those 4 kills to get that um, bleed, the, the chance, not the chance, but to be able to apply the bleed, I apply it every time I shoot an enemy within 15 meters. And also with this chest piece, um, I repair 3 to 48 percent of my armor per second for every enemy that is bleeding within 15 meters so um, for one person is 3 for 2 is 6 for 3 is 12 for 4 is 24 and 5 is 48 percent and I'm also using protection from elite mods so and I'm also using the stinger hive so I can um, apply bleed to multiple enemies so I can get um, that buff for that 48% I try to to get that 48% um, repair on my armor and I'm also using this two-piece golden gear it gives me 10% status effects and 1% armor regen and I have this roll with crit damage and crit chance and if we go over to the anarchist cookbook um, I have it rolled instead of for armor I have it rolled for weapon damage and this is rolled with armor regen and health and it has the talent perfectly wicked which apply um, when I apply a status effect to um, an enemy it increases my total weapon by 18% for 27 seconds so now if we go over to my hunter's fury I have this one rolled for armor instead of um, weapon damage and the same with this one as well and I have this roll with crit damage too and this one I kept with weapon damage and I have this roll with crit chance and the reason I went for um, three piece instead of four piece is because if I went for four piece, I wouldn't be able to have the two piece golden gear. So I went for three piece instead. And also the reason I'm going this is because I was gonna go one piece silk cloth concern and two piece um, bellstone armory. But if I just went three piece hunter um, fury, it's better because I get more SMG damage and more armor on kill. Not just that, I also get this hundred percent health on kill. So, yeah. And I'm also using the Crusaders um, Ballistic Shield as well. And um, now if we go over to my stats, I have 44% crit chance, 69% crit damage. Now if we go over to my armor over here, I'm, I'm at 1.2 million armor and I have 248 crit 248,000 armor on kill, 17,000 armor regeneration, and I have 325 health on kill, and I have 44% protection from elites, and I'm getting that from the armor mods and also from the talent from the survivalist um, skill tree for um, that as well. So, um, yeah, that's the build. Hope you guys enjoyed me. See you guys like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.